Hello and welcome back. I'm Arumba. Thank you for joining me. Let's play some more Meek to Peak as Bohemia. How is you? Is you good? We have 81 war score, 82 war score now with Poland. That is a level 3 fort. We do need 10 troops. These guys can all group up. Okay, we are currently at negative seven reasons for peace. Poland and Lithuania are both not bankrupt, I think. We have the election on lockdown. We got four votes, nice and solid. We're at negative three reasons. Probably this next monthly tick. Nope. The sooner we peace out, the sooner we get to do the, the next war with him, so... And lucky defending the siege here from Transylvania, uh, from Poland, taking that province back. 85 war score, should do it. Alright, let's do it. Done. Boom. What a glorious war. Bring all of our troops back home. And the mission itself wants us to... Oh. Okay, we have them. We just need to have total army size at least... Oh, right, so my force limit went up because we conquered land, and apparently now I need to train more troops. Okay. That's fine. More artillery it is. We could actually release the Teutonic Order. Which is kind of weird, because Prussia was a thing, and yet the Teutonic Order cores still exist. Yeah. I think we definitely do that, right? We could also release Mazovia. We could release two one province minor subjects who would have capital forts and cores to return in the next war. That is sick. That's really good. It's kind of frustrating that we're doing uh, coring while doing an idea group right now, but. Do it. Sick. Release it. Um. I mean, we're over the relationship limit by one already. And we're allied to electors that we need. We did lose Brandenburg here. I don't think he's upset with me, though. Because there was nothing I could give him. Alright, we got him at 94. I think he's the one I stopped improving with briefly. Are we, like, a great power yet? Can I become a great power? Real quick. Just, you know, real quick. So I can great power influence him. Wait on the election, sit on the Uncored Land. I think we sit on these three, but we are definitely coring these four. I think we, yeah, we probably just sit on these cores for now. Nice, we have some money. Let's build some more dirt tracks. How are we doing on economy? We don't have a contract active, so... We're really close. Without the war reps, we're like seven or eight ducats away. Hey, we did become a great power. Excellent. That's going to make it a lot easier to make the electors vote for us. Hey, vote for me. I'm great. I need some money now. Hmm. Yeah, money. Like I said, I need some money now. Excellent. Yeah, the prestige guy would be really good right now to get our prestige up for the thing. Let's influence Brandenburg for 50 ducats. Influence this guy. It's not going to give us a lot of opinion, but it's just it's just another, you know. Oh no, General JF is dead. It's just another way to make sure their influence and their or their opinion stays as close to 200 as possible. And it's not very expensive. But which one? I don't know. Does it matter? Venice. Denmark. We should rival Venice, sure. Denmark, sure. No more written out fat fat contracts to Venice, unfortunately, but... And we should probably drill for a bit. Try to get this army strong good. Er. 
Man, Austria's still alive, age 66. The old man just won't die. Bum, 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 bum. Venice with no navy? Really? Does he have no navy? No, we, we have no navy. That's why it said no navy. Not him. We obviously have no navy. We're landlocked. That should satisfy the mission. So we get reduced local autonomy and an accepted culture. I thought this said that it was also going to give us um, prosperity. Didn't it? I swear it did. Maybe because it's not a state right now, it can't. So we should wait till it's stated and then turn the mission in. I swear it said that it gains 100% prosperity. It definitely did. So we also want the devastation to be completely gone. Bum, 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 bum. Shall we roll some more JFs? We're at 70 tradition, now's a good time for it. We are ahead of time on Miltech by 10 years. I think so. I think we turn on the edict or this thing and let's get some more professionalism from rolling some JFs. Remember, please do a game where you take all the most useless ideas and see how awesome you can be. We've had some troll runs like that. Yes, go ahead. I shall lead, uh, let's see, Shubinist. Let's see, that's spelled like that. Perfect. Also, who else shall lead? Uh, Raz Lee. Nice. Excellent. Good job, Raz Lee. Let's roll one more for good measure. Uh, Mantis. Bagan MD. Let's see, that's spelled with a J. A Y. Yep, yep, perfect. Cool. <laughs> All right, so we're over the leader limit by two. We don't need to keep the guys with no shock. Uh, this version of JF is dead. That guy doesn't have the right name. That's a couple really good generals there. Five five six four and a six six three three. I think we want to drill based on the siege pips. So I'd really like to get. A five siege bip guy. Top off relations with Pope Man. We should probably top off our relations with the Emperor just so he, you know, can't do stuff to us if he's the Emperor for a little while longer. We've maxed out relations with those electors. Might as well improve with all the other electors too for good measure. Can we rent some troops to Hungary? No. Can we rent troops to Austria? No. We rent troops to Ottomans? Yes. Interesting. Um, okay, so we can rent out 20 troops on the dot. We have five artillery right now. Let's do like four, two, and 14. Ottomans, how would you like to have the opportunity to hire my army and I'll go siege down Vienna for you? you you're for it? Excellent. I'd love to go murder Austria yet again. Bum, bum, bum. I should mod the game to have JF be the only allowed general name. Yeah, that's a bit too permanent though, isn't it? Okay, we're still not maxed out on income, so we're okay. Let's go ahead and, you know, show up with our sieges. We have control in this node enough to turn on the good edict. No. And I get enough to do it. If we turn on the trade edict here, maybe. That's the only state that we have in this node. I doubt it's going to take us to 20%, but I don't know. You never know. We just have to get 20% and then we're good. Oh, you want an alliance, Austria? Oh, I didn't realize. Sorry. I'm busy. Also, we should do, um... I should do Great Power Influence on Transylvania. While he's a one province minor. And actually, maybe even Great Power Influence on the Pope. Just to get his opinion up. It's 
kind of a lot of money, but hey, he's the Pope. We're Catholic for now. So why not? Tommy O'Royal, thank you for your resub, man. Do we have the council? Yeah. We're gonna we're gonna take it. He's gotta die eventually. Stupid old man, age 67, seriously? Provence just inherited Lorraine. We have sacked the province of Vienna. We could try to go take down Tyrol. Tyrol, excuse me. I think we do want to spy on Hungary a bit more. With the trade edict, we do not have enough control here. So let's just switch back to manpower since we always need manpower. It's possible that I need to nerf the Manpower Edict. It's so good that I find myself, at least as Bohemia right now, I, I don't have any other edict that... Like, the Trade Edict is still positive overall income, but... The Manpower Edict's like, so much better for us that I never consider running anything else, which means it might be overtuned, possibly? Not sure. You think he'll just let me siege his capital, or his mountain fort? Let's see. Are you so scared of my army that you'll let me just siege your fort? What tech are you on? Six to our seven? Sweet. Ooh. Wow. That 50 opinion was not good. I may have just actually lost the election. I didn't consider. Yikes. Um... Here, Brandenburg, do I need to send you a gift again? Uh-oh. Yeah, I haven't gifted you yet. Okay. We're okay, we're okay. It's fine. Here, just have some money. That offsets most of it. That should be... maybe enough? Not quite. Uh-oh. Maybe we can, uh... Let's grab the guy that's currently in Vienna. Set him to improve relations. Maybe we can just make... Bohemia forget about what I did, kind of quickly-ish. Allied to rival? I am allied to your rival. You've rivaled mines? Dude. He is so beneath you, man. He's got two provinces. Why are you rivaled? No, three. That's silly. Well, crap. Um... Now, of course, of course, because I, I took that click, 67-year-old Austria will die, naturally. Yeah, good idea. Well, insulting rivals does cost us prestige, but we could. We can scornfully insult Pomerania to improve relations temporarily with the guy. I think 5 prestige for 25 opinion with him should be enough. Yeah. Barely. Barely. We almost lost the support of mines. They're both upset because they've, they've rivaled each other. Yeah, it seems like he's just going to let me sack his mountain forts. Great. We're pretty strong good. Hungary sees land to the Ottomans. And immediately goes bankrupt. Neat. Whoa, um, excuse me? <laughs> that's a lot of land there. Uh, yeah, I don't know how I feel about that. That's that's a bit much, sir. Could you step away from the empire, please? You know, we're so close, I think I might actually just maintain again here. So we've done great power influence. Looks like our gift already expired with everyone. Peace. All right, fine, you money-grubbing little bastards. Here. Oh, transfer trade. Sure, that helps. Anyone else want to transfer trade? They do. Excellent. Just in general, anyone else? <laughs> want to give me some trade power? No? Can someone figure out, by the way, what happened that's messed this up? I don't know what this is. It's slightly messed up. 
it wasn't before and then someone tweaked the macro builder file or something and now it's it's a little messed up i guess we support our air on poland for a sec because it's kind of funny Isn't transfer trade that you send trade to the receivers? I'm asking them to give me some of their trade power, which makes them like me better based on the percentage of trade power they offer me. Up to a maximum of 20 opinion if they give me 100%. They can only give at most 50% if they're not a subject. So I can get up to 10 opinion for, for 100% and they offer me like 17%. It's not much, but it's like, what does it say? Transfers trade power to plus two. Why not? I'll take it. Lose professionalism or lose manpower. Well, I would prefer to not lose manpower, so... What if we instead waited another month and then just hid it in a corner under the pillows? Right, turn that into a state, and I think this mission will now also say... Yeah, see? Look at that, that's weird! It... look! Hold up. If I turn it into a not state, I didn't do anything to the autonomy, so this is okay. But watch. Look at this mission. Gain 100% prosperity in the state of Wilhelmshaven. Not gain any. That needs a custom tooltip so that it says it all the time. Because that's kind of a big deal. Free prosperity in the whole state? Wow. Do I still not have the most money? Uh, no, barely. By like, five ducats. But we're not supposed to play like we know that we're switching countries, so... Uh, let's finish our cores in the state. Alston's kind of expensive. This would be a situation where it would be really nice to have like a, a weaker version of the Edict of Absolutism so that you could try to lower devastation a little bit faster. But, there's a way we can do it. We can build churches. Or not churches, uh, courthouses. They also lower monthly devastation. But we need this money to trick the game into not taking my manpower, please. Am I sure that the Ottomans don't have war reps? I think we decided that we're not worried about their temporary income. We're just worried about our temporary income. It's too tedious to do the math on every single one. Right, let's go ahead and hide our manpower in the province of Champ. And we need to keep most of it this way. Click. Can I have that back, please? Thank you. Nice of you. And let's go ahead and build a dirt track in the most devastated province in the state, which is the 19% devastated province of Posden. Lack of materials, 620 ducats, or construction cost plus 15. No thanks. I'd rather not. Go into debt for that. Could impose, impose a club tax. We could also just get a whole bunch of manpower right now. But I'm actually okay on manpower. Yeah, I think I like this money. Click. And I don't care if we just took that penalty. I want this state to become prosperous as well. Oh, did I build the wrong ones? I think I just did. That's not a courthouse. What am I building? Dirt track. Yeah, I don't want dirt track. What am I building here? Dirt track. No, wrong. I don't care if I don't get all the money back. I need the, the government building. Whoopsie. Alright. So we're drilling. We do need to get our manpower, our uh, troop count back up to the full amount. So let's just get, I guess, some more artillery going. Hopefully we don't accidentally hit too high income and not get to finish off like these missions and stuff. Because once the AI, AI takes over, they're not going to do as well as us. For sure. Oh, I'm excited. I'm excited to see um, just how strong Bohemia is since we, we put them in such a good position.
Who's currently at the bottom of the ledger? Good, good idea, good question. So even if we move up, the bottom shouldn't change. It's Denmark. If we did flip right now, we would be Denmark. Our actual income is at about 50. So we're still eight ducats shy, but that's just a few more development events or dev clicks away or buildings finishing or something else, you know? It was the Pope a second ago? Hmm. Truce-wise, we are able to go after po uh, Austria. He is still allied to Hungary. We also don't have a truce with Hungary. I wonder if Austria would defend him if I fabricated on him real quick. He would. Would Hungary defend him? Aw. Hoping for a reset. Oh well. All right, we need one more artillery. And we're at about 20 minutes, so I'm going to take a short break here if you watch this on YouTube. Otherwise, stick around on Twitch, and I'll see you guys in the next couple seconds. Thanks for watching, everyone. See you soon.